What's going on, everybody? Welcome to G Myers World, and today we're going to be looking at the team of the week. Uh, what is this, week three? Okay, so look, pretty much right here, you can either go and start buying packs like a Wild Savage, or you can play the solos first to see what you're going to get. Now, every week that they come out with this, they do give you uh, new solos um, to you know possibly get something to help you towards um, completing the set for the, uh, the team heroes. We're going to go ahead and take a look at those. Um, I usually don't get anything from these or something really, really bad. So that's neither here nor there. Uh, some of you guys have a lot better luck than I do. But let's go ahead and take a look at it. Right off the bat, though, I know Jalen Ramsey didn't get a team um, team of the week. I thought he should have. They gave it to, what are, what are the two heroes, T.Y. Hilton and Harrison Smith? Harrison Smith did ball out, but in my opinion, uh, man, Jalen Ramsey was just a goon. Um, I'm pretty sure it's going to be really ridiculous. His pricing, 780K. Are you serious right now? He's a 90 speed. Yeah, this card right here is going to be wild. Um, it's probably the only card when compared to uh, some of the cards that I have that I would consider. Obviously, let me see, catch. You know, a lot of the things are the same zone, press. You know, he has a, the plus three speed, but I don't think that really matters as much with the way Madden is as far as beating people deep. Um, his acceleration is two point higher. Uh, what about his hit power? His hit power, um, let me see, go down, right, to 81. All right, so he's 82. All right, so overall, he looks like a really, really bad, 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 in a good way card. Like that, he, to me, is worth more than Harrison Smith. I'm just saying. Um, after that, look at Demarcus Lawrence was a whole right. Uh, he was just a goon. Um, he was definitely an outright goon. Um, I don't think I have any need for him right now. Like I said, um, it, it, it just doesn't make the 76 speed. You need fast dudes. I got to keep Frank Clark there for now. I really can't play games with that as far as the way that the game operates. So, I'm not going to even look at that right now. Um, other than Preston Brown was all right. Okay, Melvin. And then as we get into the 70s, I, you guys already know how I do. Unless you get these cards and you're trying to get rid of them really quickly, I wouldn't even recommend putting a 70 anywhere in your lineup. But this Jalen Ramsey is an outright goon, man. He's just, right now, he, he I'm not spending almost a million coins from him. I'll wait for his price to come down, but he's a goon. Looking at uh, week three, uh, team of week master offensive player, T.Y. Hilton, you know, okay, bro, you played the Browns, dog. Like, you know what I'm saying? I would have much rather give it to Stephon Diggs. I think Stephon Diggs, you know, deserved it a little bit more. Uh, it could just be my opinion. Um, you know what I'm saying? But it just looks like they, I guess they didn't want to show too much love to the Vikings, it looks like. Like, I don't know. Because if you look at both the games, like, come on, man. You already know how the Browns do. Like, they're going to do you dirty all over the place. But um, let me see. Route running, catching traffic, jumping, elusive. It's a decent card. Um... I don't know if I would really go there with it, though, um, as far as paying, you know, paying that kind of cash. Sammy Watkins was really, really good as well. Oh, Kareem Hunt, finally. Finally, bro. Finally, Kareem Hunt gets a car. Let's see his speed. What's his speed looking like? Okay. Bro, okay. Are you... Mm, oh, bro, you you know like how you start... Mm, somebody doing something you don't like? Oh, my God. That price... It like I mean, Well, not the price. The price is, is expected for 85 overall. But that speed, though... Do they not realize that this man ran ridiculously or over the New England Patriots week one? And he's continued to do that throughout the weeks? I, look, I, I think he's been disrespected. I think he's been totally, totally disrespected with that card. Kelsey, I'm not really worried about centers right now. Jared Goff, don't even, even bother doing that. Mercedes Lewis should have had a higher card in my opinion. What is his catch? His catch should be, oh, they don't have one? Because his catch rating has to be high because he got blasted uh, by the Ravens in the end zone and still held on to it. As far as everybody else that's there, um, I don't really see much of, um, you know, any reason for you to get the other cards that I haven't mentioned. The Sammy Watkins, though. Let's take a look at Sammy Watkins really quickly. Okay, you going for that kind of money? Okay. Yeah, bro. Okay, 88 speed. I think 88 might be, like, EA's favorite number, dog, because everybody has an 88 speed for some reason. I don't know. Like, I'm not spending that kind of coin on a card that has an 88 speed, bro. Like, what's happening right now? I don't even care about the other stats, but Kareem Hunt, I'm very disappointed. They could have at least given him, a, like, a 90 speed. That dude flies, man. And even, like, that Cohen guy from the Bears, I, I, I don't know what's going on. But as far as the sleepers, I'm telling you right now, if I were you and you were me, you probably would be making this video. But if I were you, listen, this right here, I would look after this Jalen Ramsey and see if somebody can get a snipe on him or something. Um, because realistically, nobody's spending a million coins on that. But I will tell you this right now, it's a high probability that he's going to be around the 300, 400 range once it levels out. Maybe you might snipe him at 200K. I will look out for that just to make sure. But he, to me, is the sleeper. He's the sleeper of week three.
um, without a doubt. Uh, I don't see anything else, any other card that I would rather have than this card right here at this moment uh, for Team of the Week 3. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the commentary. Let me know what you're looking for, what cards you're planning on getting, and I'll check back in with you guys at another time. Until next time, one love.